So I'm going to teach you how to make this. You need a paper trimmer. A paper trimmer. A paper trimmer. Grab one. Hurry. Go get one. They're in the... No, you need a paper trimmer. Oh, I was, I was telling, talking to I you. I was telling them. But I was talking to you. I'll cut it. I'll cut it for you. Oh, thanks. No problem. We're going to make the pinwheel tower card. Pinwheel tower. Pinwheel tower. The you tower need of pinwheel. A piece of... Let's see if we can see everybody on both screens. I right? Think so. Okay, so we're gonna cut this at four and a quarter. Four and a quarter? Yep. And you know you can cut two of these at once. This is the regular basic white, yeah. not the thick kind. And then we're gonna go this mm -hmm. way at five and three quarters. Five and three quarters. Set that aside because we'll need it. It says lots of stuff at the top. I thought so. She can see all that. There you go. But don't want to see our guts. Better? <laughs> okay. So you have these two pieces. I can't push her stuff out That's of the way That's a punch. Anymore. See? Is that better? Less junk, I hope. I hope so. Okay, I think it is. Yeah. All right. So if you're just hopping on, we are making a pinwheel tower. Yes, card. Card. That fits in a regular envelope. And it fits in an envelope. How cool is that? What? So we started with a sheet of eight and a half by eleven, and we cut it to four and a quarter, and then this is five and three quarters. Three quarters. Now we're gonna score. So always either take this dude off or push him all the way to the bottom because that's your cutting blade. Okay. Hey, Chrissy. On the long side, we are gonna score at three quarters. Three quarters. Three quarters. I always score three quarters over here because it's I'm easier. I'm not even gonna look at how you do this because I do. And then it totally I'm gonna flip backwards. it around. And because I want this guy over here. You could, I could have done it here, but I just feel like I can't hold it as nice. And then we're going to score at one and a half. I know I'm not doing this upside down, Rebecca style. And then I'm going to score at two and a quarter. Two and a quarter. And then three. Three. That's one of them. Look, I'll do this one this way just to show you that it's harder for me to hold it. Because I don't think you believe me. It's just harder. Three quarters. I'm not even computing what you're doing because it's one and a half. Way. <laughs> Two and a quarter, right? Yes, and three. That's yours. Oh, thanks. Okay. So that's the first piece. Hang on a second. Now we need two and three, four, two and three quarters by four and a quarter. I thought it said Mitch. I don't know who that is. It does. Oh, I don't I know who it, it is either. I thought it said Mitch. I don't know. I was like, why is he watching? So four and a quarter by two and three quarters. You need three of these. Three? For each card. And we're both doing it. Thank you. I feel like you're kind of like it. That doesn't work. That's what I Jane's thought. here. Hey, Jane. Which Jane? Hi, Jane. My Jane had to go see her mom. All right. There's one for you. That's for you. I need another piece of white. Hang on. We're making a pinwheel tower card. Are you just saying that or is because somebody asked? I'm just saying it. You're like my commentator. <laughs> All right. Four and a quarter. Four and a quarter. By two and three quarters because I need three of these. Per card, right? Per card. So you need six for us. Very, oh, we've been doing math. <laughs> I'm surprised we could even do that. That was an easy Those one. Those two are for you. So now I have three. You just need your yep. two. Now I need two more. Oh my gosh, she even did that. <laughs> Look at that. Amazing. I was I pretty have a sure degree. That was right. She has a degree. That's awesome. All right, we need liquid glue, and I'm hoping there's two in here so there's, we don't have to fight over that one. There's this one? There should be another one over there somewhere. I like that you always have me go looking for it. Well, there's, I feel like you're brave. Here's one-ish. Okay. You need a bone folder. Oh, I see some of those. Look at the, there's a brand new one. Look at that. Nice. He needs to be something done to him. All right, so I'm gonna take this dude. This dude. This dude. Does this become the tower? So we're going to burnish all of these burnish. Lines. That's what that's called. Did you know that? I did. I think I used. I think I said burnish or varnish. That's varnish. <laughs> You're gonna varnish this. Hey Sarah. Hey Linda. Fold. We're gonna make nice crisp folds. Nice crisp folds because we're gonna create a doo doo. -do. <laughs> <laughs> a tower. A tower. See, it's gonna be like that. Makes sense. I probably wasn't on Becca's camera, so you couldn't see, but now you can. All right, or a chapstick holder. Oh, hey, I can think of other box. things make now. Make a lip gloss holder. What else would fit in there? A big roll of Smarties. Take a Hmm. Hmm. Look at that. Sorry. I'm thinking of all oh, kinds of things. Stella? I just did that. Where were you? Standing right next to you. 
All right, so I'm so going to put glue on this guy. And then he's going to go flat there, right? Yep. Okay. Oh, I think you gave me a dead one. I think I have a full one. I bet you do. <laughs> Oh, I just slung glue. Oh my goodness. It's on my shirt. It's everywhere. That's awesome. So we're going to make our little chapstick holder -y part here. And so if you go like that, once you get it there, then you can lay it down and it will push it down. Look at, do you see what I'm doing? She's not watching because then you don't have to fight with it. I didn't have to fight with mine. My look, I, look at, I have glue everywhere. A blend. Ooh, a blend would fit in there, Chrissy. This will still be long. There's a whole pile of them somewhere. Look at it's all the way over here. <laughs> You're crazy. I know. It's on my shirt. It's everywhere. All right. So you got this dude. Now you need these dudes. Those dudes. And so now, because I have to create my pinwheel, you're you gonna put you your. You want to put the pretty paper on these first? No. You sure about that? I'm positive. Okay. She is positive. So you're going to put your glue here on this dude and then stick this guy on and then we're going to turn it and put glue here. So you're just going to keep spinning it around like a pinwheel. Yes. Like a pinwheel, but you want to put your glue here, not on the white separate piece because you don't want to have too yeah, much glue. Exactly. And make sure that you got it on there. And each time you can fold it down like I did flat and then you will get it in there. Oh, look at that. That's what I was trying to show somebody. I wasn't watching. She wasn't paying attention. So then I just go to the next top layer. Yep, you got it. Oops, we need a little more right there. All right, who's made one of these cards already? I know you guys are some crafty people out there. You know. If you are in. I feel like I keep poking it weirdly though. There we go. I like it this way better. If you're in our monthly stamp club, you're going to get to make one of those in there too. Because we make fun things in stamp club. We do. We make fun things all the time. I'm just saying. I we didn't plan this. This is very spontaneous tonight. It really is. We were, we were working we on were, club. We were doing <laughs> Who's that? Chrissy says she's made one, but it wasn't perfect so it went in the trash. Oh no. Uh oh, mine. I wasn't paying attention, and mine is not going to be perfect now either. Oh, gosh. Come on, get in but there. But you know what? It's going to work. Right. It's going to be okay. What's, Look, not, what's wrong video. with it? It was off just a little bit. Just a smidgen? Yeah. All right. So I think the first person that I watched do this, I feel like she put her designer series paper on first, but I could be wrong. But the most recent one that I watched, she does it this way because you can tuck ever so slightly right here so mm -hmm. that you're not worrying about it not sitting right when you go to stick stuff on here. Okay. Anyway. Paper. Paper. Here's Let's the paper. See the paper. Ooh, the puppies and the kitties. Oh, I just grabbed paper. I love these. Because then, do you use the pretty pattern side? You're going to use both. Oh, we're going to use Because we're going to alternate. I love this grumpy cat. I, I mean, can't show the sample, but I can show it to you. So, see, so remember, so this is like, this is my main part of the card. Uh huh. And then, like, this is where I could write. I didn't finish this. page. Yes. Mm -hmm. But so I kept, I kept busy here. And so I did a busy and a, and a. So, like, so, this side on one side yeah, and then so this side on the other it. side. Yes. And then you floppy yes. floppy. You got you it. You use all your paper. You got it. That made no sense to you guys, but <laughs> it makes sense to me. So it's all good. Just pull some paper out. One of each I want, and we'll I want, decide. I want the stockings. That one's really cute. And because he's got a grumpy cat and I really like this grumpy cat. She's into the cats. Okay. I like the kitty cat. Oh, do you need one more? <gasps> Look at there's a visual on this one. How many did I say we needed? I don't know. Three. One, two, three, four. But one. I don't know. Just give me four. It'll be safer. <laughs> you want one with no critters? Yeah. Let's have somebody with no critters. There's just stockings. Oh, right. Light bulbs. I like the lights because look, it goes with this guy. Okay. And I think they would go well together. I think they right. go well. So watch us mess this up. <laughs> Do you want this to be on a big a big side or a little side? Well, what's on his other side? Well, because I think this. Should be, be like on the, super cute over here. Okay, on I just the big side. To make sure we're on the and same. And then just a little, page. you know, piece of the little stocking guys over here. So it's going to be four inches. Four inches. Think this way, right? I always have to think four, and then I'm going to go short. Yes, that's right. So we're going to do four inches okay. by two and three quarters. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you recognize these numbers? It's a quarter inch more than what the thing bubble was. There's four. one for you. Okay. 
And I'm gonna take one. This one's gonna be good. This let's not let's not start sticking stuff on yet though. So I'm, I'm take not. just chill. Are you sure that's right? I'm positive. Are you positive? And then <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't go to the bottom. You said it doesn't? No. Oh sugar plum <laughs> fairies. <laughs> Give me that sheet of paper back. <laughs> right here that's what happened this is for she can't corners. read her notes <laughs> oops she wanted it to be four because that would have been nice even a mat mat right okay oh. out of your 12 by 12 right, two and three quarters that part you can go <laughs> yeah and then you'll also need one at two inches for the other side and two inches right okay lay that on there make sure i did and that you right. took my card i did not you, I com took mine. you confiscated my card this is mine. no oh, it's not no. yours is this right is there sorry Make sure I did that right. I'm pretty sure I did. You didn't believe me last time. Right? Right? Yes. yes. And then that guy fits over there. Okay, phew! Now I'll cut mine because I'm going to use the same paper because it'll just make life easier. So we're going to put him over there. And I like to lay out all my pieces and then plan. That's then, me. Those are mine. See, oh, okay. I can see how that does. It tucks underneath of there see? and then you don't have this weird white border because he kind of goes in that yes. little gapage. So, hey! You were right, Mom. I hear it. I don't know how to say those words. <laughs> the order is very confusing. <laughs> you are a brat. So here's what I say. I'm going to cut all this paper, and then you can lay it out and decide who you're going to put with who. Hey, Janice, maybe... you found us. Sorry we were late, by the way. We were doing math. Now we're doing more math. Oh, my gosh. And already messed up once, so. Oh, because oh. this has, like, patterns on both sides. I know. So I said, get all your paper. I know, I hear what you're saying. But you weren't believing it. I just cut off their heads. Aww. Now he's really a grumpy kitty. <laughs> He'd be a cute one. You might be able to, like, fussy cut him out even. Ooh. He almost didn't make it. Oh. <laughs> oh. That poor dog. For you? Thank you. So you might end up saying that you don't like this side and you're only going to use that. You know what I mean? Like, even this one, I'm kind of, like, thinking this isn't going to work either. Like, watch. Do you want a different paper? Four and a quarter. No, I think I can get it to work for you, at least, for a big one or a little one. I want a grippy cat. You want a big one or a little one? I want a big one. A big one? A little one. Which one? I don't know. What, what, how does oh it work gosh. easier for you? Two and three, oh, I can get a two and three quarters one, almost. Oh, it cuts them off. That inches. really cuts them off. I know, but I'm going to cut some off and go back and look at, we're going to go like this. Get a dog head and go like this. Oh, I did it wrong. <laughs> I was like, what are you doing? I gave you a sheet of butts. <laughs> I don't want this the other side. And I have to. <laughs> look, you just cut him out. He's so sad. <laughs> He's definitely <laughs> judging you. <laughs> yeah, he's got to go this way. Like that. Two inches. Okay. Now he's right. See? Thank you. I did know what I was doing a little bit. <laughs> See, now, <laughs> now he's little. mad because he's got all these dog <laughs> ones. <laughs> back of paper, please, because I can't do these dogs and cats. <laughs> oh, there's too many critters on this paper. But they're so cute. I'm gonna use these darn stockings. All right. <sighs> Chrissy, was it this dramatic when you did it? You were alone, so that should have helped. <laughs> <laughs> how many pieces do you have? How many big, how many little? I have three big. Okay. And four small. Okay. Five small. Two and three quarters. Because I have butts. By two. <laughs> Do you want some stocking paper? Yeah. There you go. So what do I have? One. That should be enough to As play. long as I've got that, that's what I need. All right. Whew. That was exhausting. I think I want those together. So my card is going to fit in an envelope too if I didn't say that already. I promise you. Look. Fits right in there. So this is going to be the front of my card. So I want to start. So th that's for my brain. Oh. I was so like, that, how did you know? Then I would because I'm going to plan it that way that I want to start that way. Do you see? And so I'm probably going to leave 
this white and I'll put a label here or maybe a strip of something oh like that but I wanted to get it started so that you could see what we're doing because it is a little chaotic so that guy maybe I think I'll start with the lights I don't know what she's gonna do but I'm gonna start with the lights hi Ellen so I'm gonna put my glue and I do highly recommend using some liquid glue because it you gives you wiggle wiggles. room Room. I'm gonna get that guy. It probably won't be perfect. I've only made like two of these. I'm completely lost. It's okay, Brenda. So if you pick out your paper, just pick out the paper. This paper was a little harder than I really thought, so that's what happened. I will post the measurements. It will make perfect sense. You see how we did this, correct? This part was easy. So then you have to know that this is four and a quarter by two and three quarters and this side is four and a quarter by two inches so that's the same size turn those butts upside down and create a bottoms up card <laughs> guess who said that Brenda will be she really <laughs> so so the measurements aren't hard it's just the placement of the paper so our math I'm sure is what confused you so and it's that way all the way around okay oh you missed the first step well then that makes sense why you're confused now i understand this is going to be the front i'm going to come back to it okay so i'm going to flip here's the next page and i think we're going to do some of these little dudes oh that's cute i don't have these stamps do you have these stamps? i do yeah we used them didn't we we did and the reason that we attached before putting our glue on is because then this can tuck under there and it doesn't stick out. And I'm not even watching what she's doing because me doing math is very dangerous because I don't want to see what she's doing because I, I'm trying not to us to not copy each other because we're already doing the same card. I'm just using the, the corresponding opposite side of the paper. And then I can add little... Um, tags or little label punch outs or I think I'm going to fussy cut one of these critters somewhere along the line. That's what I was going to do. Well I'm saying it out loud so you don't tell me that I took it from I you. These. I, I, like, I like this one but I don't like that one. It's better that way. Let me go back and see what I did at the beginning. Okay. Where's the rest of my paper? I had dog paper with where they went. How many? Becca! <laughs> You're evil. I thought it was mine. No! Because look at how cute that is. I know, I was gonna cut the box out. No, I have scrappy paper for that. Okay. I think I'm even gonna not make that my first card. I'm gonna make that my first card now, because that's cute. That's why I don't care. I'm just gonna assemble, and I will figure that out later. Well, everyone I've watched is like, oh, plan it. But I'm kind of thinking I'm planning not a isn't always great. I'm not a planner. I'm not either. See, I was trying to work out of my comfort zone. I am a throw it together and then figure it out. <laughs> cute so you're getting it right so this will be a page this will be a page and then I got two more pages now who haven't I used I'll use that one so we're gonna probably use this one here cuteness Listen, did you finish yours there's a whole I know, so tray I was of labels. Ready to go get it. It's right behind me. I had a feeling you thought it was somewhere else, so I was trying to help well, it you out. It looks like on the floor at some point. I know, but so. it's not today. And then this guy still needs to be done. Oh, look, she left me some paper. What else you got over there? These. What are you doing with them? Hey, it's like I like this guy on here. I don't, you don't have any, you don't have these stamps? No. What's wrong with you? I know. It's tragic. This guy is like I have so all kinds cute. of Christmas stuff though. What do you have? It's all in a stack. It's not alphabetical, the newest stuff. There's a Christmas to remember. Just putting cute words on there will be super cute. I don't like that one. I hope that's the same one. Look at those blue nails matching your, oh, my watch is actually purple. Can you see that? But it does look cute, right? <laughs> what color, I'm getting my nails done again tomorrow. What color should I do? 
I'm not doing flowers down here at the base again because look at it, it screams. Look at my cuticle <laughs> when it starts to grow. So I'm not doing that again. Which I have the new Christmas is right there in that stack. And then there's Christmas sporadically oh, through there. All right, I'm gonna use this guy. And I kind of want the cat too. We messed that up once already. Let's see if I can do it again. Oh, that little parakeet's cute too. Almost. Let's take a little more off of there. Oh, what's wrong? This one hasn't been put together. Huh? That makes me laugh. What kind of sorcery <laughs> is this? Oh, I was supposed to make a big piece. Why did somebody stop me? Yeah, that doesn't work. Gosh dog got it. Oh, this is why we're spontaneous, right, Beck? Actually, we kind of just named it to fit how we work. <laughs> we didn't plan to like, oh, let's just be spontaneous. No, oh, we had to name it. It does to... look more like a rising sun, I agree. <laughs> Two and three quarters is what I wanted. Meryl. I fixed it. Yeah, and I'm going to put him over here. Yeah. Like that. Did you take my glue? Nope. Yes, you have both of them. I think you gave it to me. I don't think so. I don't think so. So we're sticking this guy on here. Why do you I'm not put stickers on your stamps? I haven't used them yet. I don't know what I did to this piece of paper, so I gotta give it a little haircut. You guys, we're not perfect. <laughs> it's a hot mess here. Quite literally, because I don't think your air conditioner is working. Oh, you're hot tonight? It's a little chilly. It's not chilly in here. <laughs> So then you have like all these little scrappy pieces you can come in. Oh, that's cute. Or we can go here. Let's see what else we got. I was kind of liking it over here though. Is it too long? So now we're just building. Yeah, there were supposed to be daisies, Melissa, on my fingers. And yeah, she didn't nail it, that's for sure. <laughs> cutting. There's dies for this, but I don't own them. I do. Oh, that was like uber crooked. My bad. It's not stuck. Did you mess it up? It's like super crooked. What the heck? Pull it off. It won't come off. Gently. It's going to peel it and it's going to be so bad. What were you doing? I'm All sorry. this because she didn't like that I didn't put them together yet. I'm sorry. How bad is it? Am I gonna cry? No, I mean, it's usable. It's just gonna be a little off when you go to stamp. Oh, so it's gonna make my customers crazy. Probably. It won't bother me, because I usually don't even have them on anyway. There's a cute little stocking we can stick down here in the corner. No, no. So I don't recommend dimensionals or thick whisper white, or whisper white, basic white, because this card gets pretty thick, pretty fat. I don't like it at all. We're gonna go here. Pretty fast. So, and what's on the other side of you? I might just do them lights again because I kind of like them. Not perfect, and that's why I love you. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I want to do better, but you know, actually, I think I wanted to go down the side. Nope, too late. If you try to get this perfect every single time, you're gonna make yourself crazy. I mean, I just mean crafting in general. It doesn't have to be exact. It's nice when it comes out perfect, but it's not always feasible. I am all sticky now. All right, I need some labels. 
Did you find some good stamps that you like? They're gonna work. They're gonna work. <laughs> It would have been better if they were put together. Oh my goodness. Complain. Complain. Messing up my groove, Complain. man. I had to stop to put stamps together. It's tragedy. Look at Oh, that's what I should have done. We could do it over. Who don't we like? We'll do it over here. Look at this one's kind of boring right here, so we're gonna put this guy here. And we'll probably stamp something cute. What do we got? Have a holly jolly Christmas. Love and joy come to you and may it last the whole year through. That's a cute one, but I think he's too big. I'm gonna use this one. And I'm gonna just, what color are you gonna stamp in? Cherry cobbler. Is there any in here? <laughs> That's my foot. Oh, oh, oh. I stepped on something hard. That's my foot. <laughs> no, that bucket. <laughs> oh, sugar plum berries. There's none in here. I'll go get it if you talk. Oh, you want me to talk now? You have to you? talk. All right, well, let's see. I think I'm going to do Friends Like You, make the season special. And then this little tis the season, I think, is going to fit really well on this little taggy dude. So I think, oh, it's going to be a close one. So close. How about magic's in the air? Nope. It goes to show that we all make mistakes. Yes. You know what? I think this does fit on here. It might be a little bit off. <gasps> Pretty. Let's see. Do you have another block in here? You're gonna laugh. I do. What kind of block is that? <laughs> really big, big old monster. <laughs> and she's gonna hog the ink. So I have a um, a cutout from the what are these cut the contour dies right? We're gonna stick that there. How stinking cute! We need something cute over here now. Do we have a short little word? Oh, Mary. Oh, can I see the box so I can see what we have? Oh, disregard. They're all too big. Oh, you oh, took my little, I was, I was going to do. What? You took the little taggy dude. Here, I have the whole bag. <laughs> Here you go. Oh. Compliments of my cutting fairy. If you want, you guys, I will go back and cut it from the beginning, the, that base, so that you can see. We're going to do joy to the world. So no dimensionals, which is kind of tragic in my opinion, but it really makes it too thick if you do. Seriously, in some intense thinking over here because she is silent tonight. Just silent. I am thinking. I'm actually impressed that all of the colors I wanted are here. Not all of them. I had to go get one. Right? Oh, it's so close. Oh, Mary, Mary, Mary. What if you brought him over a little bit? I mean, you'd have to do it again. Practice here with one color and see if you can make it work. Do you know what I mean? All right, let's see. Wishing you may the love of the season warm your home and fill your heart. Let your heart be light. Ooh, it's so close. I need that to go on something. Don't be I'm wasting gonna do my tags. Tag. I'm just gonna do the two. Mary, Mary, it's cute. And then I think there was like a critter I can cut out. Where's your paper? That one doesn't quite make it. So all the boring papers. Where's all the ones with the cute critters on it? You took them all back. Because I had extras over here. <laughs> and then you confiscated them from me. There's that one. Hang on. 
Let me get them. Here's some more. We have quite the mess going on. I had the space cleared off tonight, Brenda. What did you do with my paper? I left it and you didn't take it, so I moved on. Let's do... I need scissors. You gotta talk. I'm the only I'm... one talking. What do you like when you're the only one talking? <laughs> <laughs> that was a little evil. Was it? It was. Are you sure? I'm 100% <laughs> sure. <laughs> That was just a little evil. You like when you're the only one talking. I don't. I'm going to cut this kitty cat out. <laughs> now she's going to give you a play-by-play. -play. Cutting <laughs> is a lot like coloring, and it's very hard to talk. I'm coming behind you. And stay focused and not cut ears off because this is a little... Ooh, are you baby, cutting something tiny? Baby kitty whiskers and packages with red bows. Let's see if this is gonna fit. I think it's close. Oh! It doesn't fit. So we're going back to this guy. I think it'll fit here. Because <laughs> it's Mary, 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 grouchy cat. <laughs> Only you. So it looks like he's just holding onto the card. That's cute. He's going there. It's, it's like the Bah Humbug cat. The Bah Humbug cat. <laughs> all right. I'm going to use my scissors because I can't reach anything else. It's all by her. I'm poke these little dudes out. Becca, have you checked your comments lately to make sure that you're good? Yeah. Someone asked if the card fit in an envelope, yep. and then Chrissy answered. Thank you, Chrissy. And, and it so sure I does. was just letting it ride. They were taking care of it. That's awesome. I didn't want to cause extra confusion. Oh, I don't want to cover the cat or the dog. <laughs> Mary, Mary, Mary. Stay. Hard to concentrate and talk. There we go. Now I have three Marys and I feel better. Oh, did you add one somewhere else? I did. See? Mary, Mary, Mary. Grumpy cat. Mary, Mary. <laughs> You're too funny. Let's see. I want another right. little labely dude. I got some over here. Which kind do you need? That one that you already used? No, I don't want another one over oh, okay. you used. That's not fun. I didn't want to cover up the cat because that would make me sad. So we're going to go like that. I think I just want it. Cute! Like a little rectangle in here. So like if you wanted to journal, you could since I've like covered everything with paper. Oh, did you do everything with paper? I did. I like it though because I'm too. not big on journaling all the time. Or writing a message. And writing just a whole sign bunch. And, and, like, I feel like if I'm going to display this, like, I don't want a bunch of words all over the place, like, handwritten. Fair I just enough. want it to be pretty. I can I cut out this, this happy dog to kind of So what did you do this weekend? My grumpy cat. Um, what did I do this weekend? This weekend I had... I'm going to tell you my angry Alyssa stories in a minute. Oh, joy. <laughs> We got our engagement pictures done this weekend. They're so stinking cute. And I started cleaning my craft a lunch. Uh, that was pretty awesome. And did you decide on what color papers you had so many of? Soft sea foam, pool party, uh -huh. and coastal cabana. Nice. <laughs> I had like four packs of each of those. I'm like, oh my gosh. Apparently, I really was going to do a project with all these colors. You or just something. really like them. I just really liked these colors. And I couldn't find the pack that I had already bought, so I bought another one. That's kind of funny. And of course there was like a bunch of white, but I feel like white doesn't count because you really can't have too much white. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I'm back. Hang on. Low battery. There we go. Oh, he's kind of red and blends in, so we're just going to stick it. Oh, he looks really cute right there. 
that. Oh, where'd you find those little dudes? On the paper. <laughs> so good. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. But this could be like a little mini scrapbook. You could put pictures on here. Like your favorite Christmas pictures, just a couple. Because you know how we all take like 5,000 pictures and then we never do anything with them? Yeah. So like just pick a few favorites. And I really like being able to just like pull some of these fun shapes to kind of put on here. I think I need to have my cutting fairy do some in on a couple of neutral colors too. Oh. What do you think? That sounds like a plan. Maybe have a holly jolly. Well, let's go next to that one. And that one already has words. Maybe I'll do. Uh, is there another little critter I wanted to cut out? I don't think so. And I really don't want to cover him up. So maybe just something that's going to fit right there. I cut out a little parakeet because I think he's adorable. Oh, he's a fun shape. Ta -da. I feel like I need some birds or something over here. And I have like this craft a lanch going on. All right, so I'm going to tell you. We, today was infusion day, so we went to see Alyssa. Chuck and I, because Becca never goes to see her. That sound is really, really mean, and I don't like that at all. That was just straight up mean. It was really funny. No, that was mean. <laughs> it's hard to go and see her because the people that, that work there are horrible. How about that? Is that better? No, apparently it's not. Look at me. I'm not mad at you. Are you mad at me? No. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Do you forgive me? Of course. Did you show Mitch the picture I made? Yes. Oh, okay. I didn't know if you showed him. <laughs> See, you're just on a mean street. <laughs> She's being a mean girl. I'm not being a mean girl. Who are you talking to? Christy. She says, woohoo, I was right when I guessed Coastal Cabana, but I always have at least three of those on hand. <laughs> it's crazy. I should go through and see how many I have of things because I have a whole bunch of why did I do that. So anyway, so we go to see Alyssa today because it's infusion day. Right. And the Wicked Witch is there. That would be the manager of the group home who hit Alyssa and also brought a gun to work just saying um <laughs> and did you know that that's not i might have already told you this but i'm very obsessed with it that is not a reportable offense because no one was injured with the gun just you know of in a group home with people who are of psychiatric issues but anyway <laughs> so we go in she's there she starts out talking nice to me but at the last doctor's appointment actually the last two doctor's appointments the doctor said that Alyssa had to have pre-treatment of Tylenol and Benadryl before her infusion and that she would take care of it and send the order. I assumed that happened because Nikki was on the call with, oh, did I said her name, because the Wicked Witch was on the call with me and she's in charge of this. This is her job. So if the order didn't come, then she needs to follow through because it's on the plan. The doctor sends a plan over, a typed up plan that this is what we're going to do and it's all on there. What you looking for? I have more pretty stamps over here I if you need another them. Critter. Which critter? Here's a big guy. I want the one that has the little mouse holding the box. There's or one. the cat in the box. I don't even know which one that is. Oh, this one. Yeah. The, with the dogs. That one. Yeah. Um, so I went in and asked her if Alyssa could get her Tylenol and Benadryl, and I heard her yell from the office, I don't have any Benadryl. Oh, okay, fine. So I walked back there because Alyssa's looking nervous, and um, walk into the office, or I stood outside the office, actually, in the hallway, and I was like... Well, she, then can we at least just give her her Tylenol if we don't have Benadryl? Because this infusion makes her uncomfortable. She's like, well, I just asked her if she has any body aches, and she told me no. I'm like, but it's not for body, body aches. If you didn't get an order, that's fine. Tell me you didn't get an order. I mean, it will be for body aches when the body aches start, but we're trying to prevent it. Hence the reason the doctor ordered it. And so she's like, no, I didn't get an order. Okay. I'm like, that's fine. Don't worry about it. And so I'm like, come on, Alyssa, we'll just go do your infusion. And she goes, oh, no, Alyssa, you come here. And she hands her two Tylenol and says, I love breaking the law. Here you go. And I thought to myself, yes, you do. And <laughs> I didn't say it because I'm supposed to behave when I'm there. 
And so Alyssa stepped away and I was, and she, this woman looks at me and says, and you with the finger, <laughs> you don't need to be telling me what to do because you can't tell me what to give her. And I said, well, actually I can, I have medical power of attorney. And she's like, no, Alyssa has to tell me. And I really don't care about your medical attorney, medical power of attorney. And she does this. I swear if anybody ever does this to me again, I will probably lose it. She goes, bye-bye with that nasty little face. Bye-bye. Get out of my office. Bye-bye. Yeah. And I wasn't, I wasn't in her office. So I said, no. <laughs> and I stood there and my husband glared at me pretty much to tell me to get the heck away. <laughs> but anyway, she was just mean. So then, then when we were there, there's only three residents in this house and two staff members today. They have three pounds of ground turkey on the counter, three to make spaghetti for three people that pay to be there, <laughs> that bought those groceries and possibly the other two might have some, but three pounds, that's a lot. So they cook up that entire three pounds and make spaghetti sauce and go, oh, I'm sorry, Alyssa, we forgot to buy you gluten-free pasta so you can have hot dogs instead. Could you please comment? <laughs> They're ridiculous. I don't know how to fix it. I oh really my don't. goodness gracious. I was so mad. And I'm the crazy one. Me. But isn't that cute? Look at mine. You didn't look at mine. I, yours is flipping adorable and I know it because you have this brain where you think to do things like that. It's so cute. Which one's going to be your front? It doesn't need to have a front. Well, when you put it in the envelope, what's the first one they're going to see? Probably the one with the big words on it. Oh, cute. Cute. Yeah, that's what I would do. Oh, he's stuck. That's what's wrong. You didn't get him tucked. Do you see what's happening? Oh, well, I, th I think I just fixed him. They keep popping out a little bit. It's okay. The, oh, remember you did mess with I don't think you have glue on it. Okay. I think it's a glue situation. That's stinking cute. I need something right there. Yes, you do. You need well, a critter. Cut him out. Oh, a critter. So may this be a Christmas to remember and cherish and put a grumpy cat. <laughs> no. You can put this happy dog. He's too big. Well, he's on there a couple oh, times. He is. He looks kind of cute peeking on the card like that. Yeah. I like that. <sighs> so, yes, it was. <laughs> what? Laura, what she say? I don't have any appropriate words on the matter, and all my ideas end in violence in my mom's that I shouldn't encourage. And I Please can't... encourage me. Nobody else is on my side. Yeah, we're on your side. I we need just... verbal. I need verbal support from my people that care about me to say, Lisa Marie, or babe, or mom, this is freaking ridiculous. I told you it's stupid No, ridiculous. I want you to get as mad, mad as I, I am. Yeah, I'm mad. I just know that it's not going to do Laura, anything. I love you. I'm going to talk to Laura. I'm going to call Laura. Laura will give you the reaction. I just need, I need that, that I'm not the crazy one feeling. You're not. Because I feel like the crazy one. Just rubber? No. And I'm more the calm, <laughs> like. Oh, I'll tell that one. That one's a better story. <laughs> Oh, that is funny. I do remember. Yeah, tell that one. I think they'd much rather hear that story. All right. I will tell you the happy story. Well, it's still horrible, but... It's still... Because you just... It makes your heart break a little bit. But... But it's kind of funny. But it also kind of gives has, you a little giggle. So. Oh, that's cute. He is cute. Okay. All right. So, Friday. Alyssa has been doing really good lately, by the way. Let's just go there. No behaviors. She's been pretty awesome. So, she... FaceTimes me and I have friends over and she's like mom I just got glue everywhere mom I have to tell you something don't be mad <laughs> I'm like what honey she's like I might be pregnant <laughs> hysterical I haven't even told the story the people that were here <laughs> Chrissy has no words at all Janice says you're not the crazy one thank you thank you these are my people <laughs> Mom, I think I might be pregnant. And I was like, really? What makes you think that? Because <laughs> we're on FaceTime and everybody at the table can hear her. She's like, I had, I took an ultrasound. And I'm like, hmm, how'd you do that? You know, who took you for that? And she says, well, I got an app on my phone. And I said, oh, I said, you should send me that app so I can look at it. So I look at the app, bless her heart. 
It's called Ultrasound Simulator Joke. <laughs> so you scan anything, literally, because I scanned all the, the women. Stampin' and Boss. I stamped the, my, my Stampin' Boss and Cut machine. I stamped, you know, all of us women who can't have babies anymore. <laughs> I, I scanned us all, and we all, it comes up with an ultrasound, a real ultrasound picture of a baby. Well, mm -hmm. it's very realistic anyway. And so she had scanned herself because when Alyssa has an infection, which she does, um, and she hadn't started her medicine yet, and there's a whole other story to that. And so, <laughs> so she had not been given her medicine yet, so she, she starts obsessing about bizarre things, and this is usually, it's usually about having a baby. And so I'm, we're playing with this thing, and we're all laughing because we think, because she's not on. We hung up with her because I was looking at the app. So I called her back, and I was like, so... I looked at it, I'm like, can you, you know, I know you know what an ultrasound is, do you know what simulator is, and we went over that, and I'm like, do you know what the word joke means? And she's like, no, what is it? She really just didn't know. So I explained to her, you know, like, if you told someone that their hair was blue, ha, 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 and then they look in the mirror, it's not, you know, it's fake, and she, like, I thought she was going to cry, she's like, that is so mean, because what if I was? And, I mean, she was just really upset. We had to, like, try to divert her attention and I tried you know I was like why don't you go on YouTube and look at this and why don't you look at that Brenda was like you know how about hummingbirds let's look at hummingbird videos so we thought that would keep her busy for a while I was like why don't you go do that for an hour and call me back yeah she did not do that well she said she looked at a couple and they were funny haha -ha, but then she moved on and found another app and the app she was pretty sure again that she was pregnant <laughs> And so Brenda had explained to her that, you know, she's a nurse and, you know, you're not pregnant because you have to have an ultrasound only at the doctor's office. But bless her heart, she was so serious. This went on for a couple hours. It was, this is like the super, super short version. Mm -hmm. But she was just like, I just know I am. You're going to need to stop at the store before Sunday and bring me a pregnancy test. And let's just say that there's absolutely positively no way she's pregnant. And, <laughs> and today it wasn't even mentioned because she's had her medicine. Mm-hmm. Which they weren't going to give her yesterday. Did I tell you that? No. They didn't get it on Friday. Her glasses are really cute. They're brand spanking new. I, those, you know what's funny? <laughs> she had me try those on, and that was in the pile of, I almost got those. Are you sure? Because they're yeah. brand new. Yeah. She ordered them just for me. Well, they had a pair that was like just like that there <gasps> on the rack. Oh. I almost bought those. These are mine. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> they ordered her medicine, told them she had to have it on Friday. They didn't get it on Friday. I called the pharmacy. They had it ready on Saturday. And they still didn't have it come dinner time. They weren't giving it to her because we can't seem to get it to enter into our computer, so we can't give it to her because we can't log it. Have you ever heard of paper and pen? Yeah. So I was like, yeah, that's not acceptable. The doctor explicitly told the Wicked Witch that she had to start her medicine ASAP. Mm -hmm. So then they called Becca, Becca, Alyssa called me back like an hour later. She's like, I got my medicine. Of course you did, honey. Of course you did. These are so... I want to put rhinestones and ribbon and... This guy needs something still, but I don't know what. But I think they're adorable, so... I like the key. You do have an issue, though. I don't know what you did, but I, I love you, that. It's off a little bit crooked, and there's one part that's, like, not glued, but I can't get it oh. up enough to really... How about if we just stick a glue dot at top and bottom? Maybe. It might work. Do you guys have any questions? Not about all that junk, but about stamping. We are probably going to type up the next Jingle Club this week. Yeah, this week. So we can get it out. And what are we doing for Stamp Club next month? Have we decided that? Are we doing Christmas? No. Probably not. Maybe? Should we? What do you guys want to do for um, Club next month? Yeah, for a regular Stamp Club. I have some clubby people in here. I don't think I have any over here. But you can throw out your opinion, what you think we should do. This month we did the um, the plentiful plants stuff. I can't see it when you see it. And it's really it. cute. It is really it cute. It is really, really cute. I have no idea how to put the card together. Who said that? Janice. Okay. I'm going to show you. Without all the bits, okay? Paper trimmer. So you're going to take a piece of white. And I will post the measurements. Ooh, bags. You were going to do the first sets. I'm here, Larry. I got Any it. Tags? <laughs> oh, I bet tags. Is that what you mean, Brenda? Wildy? So we're going to take a piece of Whisper White, regular, basic white, and do four and a quarter. 
count. And then we're gonna do five and three quarters, like that. And we're gonna set this piece aside for just a minute. I'm gonna grab my cheat sheet so I don't tell you the wrong numbers. And then we need three pieces that are four and a quarter, which this already is, by two and three quarters. Three, two and three and three quarters. Ah! Say it for me. Two and three. Three quarters. quarters. There it is. <sighs> like that. And then like that. Get rid of these guys because we don't need them. So this makes the card base, which I thought I had a finished one over here, but I don't. Now I'm going to score on this big guy on the long side. Get rid of the cutting blade. We're going to score at three quarters of an inch. And then at one and a half. And then two and a quarter. And then three. Like that. Ta da! So that's for this. If you'll take this and grab, let me grab some paper for you. Why? So that you can make some little panels so that she sees it. Doesn't that make sense more? Maybe? Paper is this? I think this is last Club year's. ideas. Help me figure out something to do with the tiger papers. I'm trying so hard not to dislike. Who is that? Laura. Just pick out like even one color and just do all the different patterns. Does that make sense? And you're going to do four like this and four like this. Okay. Okay. That way I can put this together and then by the time I'm done you should be ready. So here's my scored piece. I'm going to take my tool. No, create bags with paper. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. That sounds like a good jingle club class. I like it. Using 12 by 12 paper mm -hmm. or 6 by 6 paper and making bags. So I'm taking all these score lines and I'm burnishing them with my bone folder. Like that. And what this does is this creates the base for our pinwheel. So it's going to fold in like that. So all I did was roll it in and go like that. So it made like a tube. So I've got to get some glue on there. And it's going to go here. That's a little much there. Scribble them down. And then he's going to go in here like so. And then what I do when I get him in there, then I can lay him down and he'll lay flat. Just give him a little burnish again. Wah! So now you have that. Okay, that's out of that large piece. Then you have these three panels that are two and three quarters by four and a quarter. Okay, we're going to go and put glue here. Get back over here. And then take this guy and lay him on here. And I think this is where Becca's got messed up because she tried to do what I tried to do the first time, which was just hold it here and like you think you're going to get it all lined up right. But I need you to close it. I need a second to get myself together here. There it is. So that you can get it all pushed down, make sure everybody's the way where they belong. See, and now it's like that. Now we're going to go to the next empty one. Always put your glue on the tube, not on the loose piece of paper because you'll never get it right where you want it. And then you'll have that ooey glue mess. I'm gonna fold it down again. Just make sure I got it, there we go. So now we have that. But you guys, you're a little crooked. And then we're gonna come do this last one. I'm gonna do a YouTube video for this one too. I think that'll be on my list of things to do this week. From like start to finish. So I'm gonna get that guy in there. And give him a fold. What's wrong? You're gonna have more than enough, don't you think? So there we go. There's the pinwheel portion. I was trying to decide why they were different sizes. Did you not get four and a quarter? Oh. I did that earlier too. This one's just bigger. So there we go. So now to finish it, I'm going to wait for Becca. She's cutting paper and I don't want to distract her. 
club idea. Help me. Oh, that was that. You already read that one. You're good. You're good. Yeah, I don't love that paper, Laura. So that might be a hard one. Thank you. And you'll write down the dimensions too. I will post it at the top of this video tonight. And then I will have a YouTube video over on my blog or on YouTube. If you guys aren't following my YouTube channel, I'd love if you did. All right, you got it? So then, again, this piece, remember, was four and a quarter by two and three quarters. All of them, the big sides, okay? So you've got one, two, three, and four. The short sides are two and three quarters this way and four and a quarter this, or no, I'm sorry, they're four and a quarter by two because this is the two and three quarters side. So that's all you're doing is cutting DSP and laying out how you might want to do it. So you could lay this guy here. Chrissy says something fall. Oh, fall's a good idea. So we're doing Jingle Club already. Good plan. And then we could go, is that what's on the other side? Yep. Mm -hmm. So you could go like this. That's a wonky piece. What did you do to it? Yeah, there was one that was crooked. I don't know what happened. Can we, can I get a new one? I There's can't. There's a little stack. I don't like him. She had one job, guys. Cut the paper. The trimmer was cutting crooked. You were on a pile of crap. Yeah, that's probably why. <laughs> that's really what the problem was. I have a glue booger. Get off. All right, so I'm gonna glue this guy. And the reason we don't put these on, everybody I think was here for that, but just in case, if you put these on your sheets first and then try to put it together, then things won't lay right because this is gonna tuck. See how it's kind of sliding under there? And it just tucks a little tiny bit, but it's really important that you don't have glue on your fingers when you're doing that. There we go. What else we got? Oh, I like that too. This is going the wrong way. I agree. <laughs> It was too late though. This is a very crooked piece too, my friend. I don't know what happened. What happened to you? Maybe we'll just leave this as the white guy. Ooh. Oh no! Do you see what happened? What did you do? He moved. Oh, it's tragedy. Where's my, um, take a pick? I saw one earlier. Perfect. We have to fix that. Take a pick, use the spatula end, and maybe you can save it. Silence, thanks for commentating this for me, at least to have some noise. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you tear a card. Creepy. And this is probably the one that's gonna go in the trash. They probably will. I'm gonna take him off and just make a new one. Will you cut me another four and a quarter by two and three quarters? Thanks, Ben. He was just too crooked. He was not gonna survive. And that's okay. That is the beauty of doing this, is that we make mistakes. We're not perfect but we can fix them. So I'm gonna stick some glue back in here. He'll have a little extra. I'm sure it was because I was talking and I wiggled and when I shouldn't have. Well, because you're using that liquid glue, you gotta let it dry before you start manipulating it too much. That's probably exactly what it was. And I think you was. probably just got too excited. Aw, you're so sweet to say it so nice like that. Ah, oh, Lord help me. I can't get it back on there now. All right, there it is. Oh, I think that's it right there. And I think you nailed it. I think my stuff is just too wet to be. Anyway, so you keep doing that layer. You could leave one white and then you would come over here and do this guy. And you just keep going around you with whatever as much paper. paper. As you want, or you can just stamp it. Back to spontaneous, exactly. <laughs> What not to do to your card? I think it's good when we make mistakes personally because then we get to show you guys that it happens. There's nothing, I mean, it doesn't make you a bad stamper. It just means you gotta try again and you just learn something. You're human. You're human. So there we go. That could cut a lot of crooked paper, so I'm not even gonna try. I'm sorry. I don't know what I happened. Don't know what ha I think it was a crooked piece of paper. She's claiming to be tired, I'm sure. I am tired. So there we I go. I didn't get dinner yet. I didn't have dinner or lunch. Well, that's not my fault. Oh, there you go. All right, you guys, thanks for hanging out with us tonight. I will post the measurements tonight and I will get a video made this week. 
with straight paper that's not all messed up. But well, these came I, out really good, I think. So they're stinking adorable. I'm just gonna go with that. I'm partial to this one. Well, you did a really good job. That's my favorite too. And look, the little happy dog's peeking around he the corner. He is. Like cat, grumpy cat. <laughs> Oh my goodness. All right, you guys, you have a wonderful week and we'll see you again on Sunday. Bye. Bye.